It's always crazy to see the changes made throughout the development of a manga between the one shot, which is like the pilot episode, and the final product. For example, did you know that in the Death Note universe, there was originally going to be a Death Eraser? Sugumi Oba's original one shot starts off surprisingly similarly to the original Death Note. Ryuk drops his Death Note for entertainment purposes, and a young boy, Taro Kagami, picks it up. Unfortunately, Kagami doesn't speak English, so he can't read the rules of the Death Note, so he uses it as a journal and writes about the bullies at school. Much to his surprise, the bullies are all dead before class starts the next day, which is when Ryuk finally appears in front of Kagami. Kagami laments because he didn't want to have the bullies killed, so Ryuk offers him the Death Eraser, which can revive anyone that's been killed by the Death Note as long as their bodies haven't been cremated yet. Honestly, it's giving Yu Yu Hakusho vibes with that rule. Much to Kagami's relief, the bullies are back in one piece at school the next day, but when two detectives arrive to investigate the situation, they all die of heart attacks in front of Kagami again, and now he has to figure out who in his class has a second Death Note. 